Hello there guys, it's Joey. So we're going to have two videos today. One's going to be a bit deeper and one's going to be a bit lighter and silly. This one's the lighter, sillier video. This is witchy bargains, especially if you live in the UK. So I went to town for a number of reasons yesterday and as I was passing through I went to the Tiger store. So Tiger is a pretty inexpensive place to get bits and pieces from. Half the time a lot of it's tatty and nonsensical, but the candles are really great. You can get these really massive sort of pillory candles, dinner candles technically, three for a pound, and they have a multitude of colours. They had a lot less of the smaller ones this time, which was a bit disappointing, as initially I went in wanting some of the slightly bigger than votive sized grey candles, and they didn't have them. And I was a bit like, ugh, oh, but you know, whatever. So three for a pound for these is pretty good. I'm trying to get hold of a mould to make my own, but in this size or I'd quite like one in the, I think it's 18 centimeters by four, but I, getting hold of them in the UK is proving to be a nightmare uh, at a price which is not extortion, basically. So for the time being, we will carry on getting the inexpensive ones at Tiger. So I got three black ones. I got two of these olivey green colour and one yellow, but the yellow one's already in use. So these are really wonderful for seven day work. If you live in the UK and you have trouble getting hold of the seven day candles. I know America have their fantastic spell jars with the seven days in. Getting those over here is an expensive process for the most part. So I tend to use these uh, for seven day work black candles can be used for a multitude of things. You can use them in banishing work, you can use them in reversal work, you can absorb negativity, you can use them in protective work, you can use them in honour of the crone goddess. Uh, quite frequently I use red or black for morrigan work. The olive green is probably going to be my Beltane candle, I think. I'm I'm tossing up at the minute between uh, switching the altar around to something a bit more red and fiery or going with the green and just tweaking it and I'm not quite sure at the minute so I'll have a think over the next day or two and we'll see. If not the olive green is a lovely sort of mid green and it's sort of is between the brown and the green so it has the sort of I tend to prefer browns for things of a earth based problem solving nature so it's problem solving getting to the bottom of something grounding off things that are getting in the way the obstacle removal and things of that nature and green is your earth based wealth based prosperity based energy so there we go. So I got some of those and they had these packs of the white which are actually a little bit smaller. So there you go and there are ten. Yeah there are ten in there and they were two pounds for this big box of those so it's a good all-rounder for having white candles. I use white candles in conjunction with black candles so you have a purification and protection energy going on when you do your protection and purification work. So you use your white to purify any funk that's in your home and then black to protect against future funk. <laughs> this sounds like an amazing song, future funk. And last but not least, was this? Yeah, this was, uh, I got picked up two of these awesome little, they're called spice jars technically. But they had a few of these with different colour lids and for me I'm going to be doing the lunar spell work in them, the lunar oils. 
So, you know, with the black colour on the top is really, really great. These were 50p each, um, which is really, really quite good. And I love the coloured lid on top. Let's just, I'll just show you how they, you know, it's pretty, it's, you know, they've got what's it seals on them so plastic seals I guess more than anything but uh, that's pretty good considering 50p so then what I want to show you is just two bits that I picked up from the holistic shop.co.uk uh, if you have been with me for any length of time I have talked about the holistic shop before uh, they are pretty amazing. So I picked up, <laughs> this looks really dodgy actually, this is your Basanta. <laughs> Look it really is. <laughs> so use the smoke to wash person's property or spaces. It's basically a smudge blend for healing protection and to banish negativity. Its leaves can be carried to boost spiritual strength or burnt. The, the herbs in the holistic shop are mostly from a Native American base, uh, so they do have a couple which are a little bit more unusual and perhaps a little bit more difficult to come by, at least in the UK. Uh, the Yerba Santa was 288 for half an ounce or 14 grams. I'm sure in America and places you can get it cheaper than that, but in the UK I've I've looked around and I don't think anywhere's as good for price and quality as the holistic shop tends to be. I wish they had more herbs and things because they only have, I think it's about 10 of the Native American herbs. And the the prices for England are really reasonable and the quality of them is good. Uh, I get my desert sage from them. It's always a really good quality and you can sort of uh, mesh that up for your own smudging blend and I was trying different frequencies of herbs for different energies of purification over the last couple of weeks just to shift it about a little bit um, which I fully recommend doing uh, to anybody because you should always treat negative energy like you would treat cleaning your home you you know you don't want to be using the same product over and over and over again in case things get resistant to it you might want to switch up a little bit and I do do that within my spiritual practice and it's good to try different things anyway and see how you get on with the energy I've already used some of mine so that's really quite wonderful okie dokie and then I got some black tourmaline. Now I got the slightly larger size, uh, which were 173 each, or you can get the slightly smaller size, which is 132. And so for one pound 73. You might be expecting little critty tumble stones. Well, no. This is the holistic shop after all. I think they are really, really pretty good. So, they don't actually talk about their... Uh, black tourmaline within properties really but technically it is the grounding crystal of choice it's really really deeply grounding it's really good for all sorts of if you're stressed and if you're negative and if you're emotional and just grounding that shiz off I keep tourmaline around the house I keep tourmaline by the bed I think it is a fantastic grounding off nonsense crystal um, it's protective as well particularly if you don't get on with some of the stronger crystals I don't have a problem with this obsidian for example I don't have a problem with it myself but if uh, it's a little bit strong the strong side for you then black tourmaline 
is a good alternative. I'll just see if I need to mention anything else because I do start yakking on and think, you know what, I bet I've missed something. Is there anything else I wanted to say? Yeah, shielding. I kind of talked about that it being quite a protective crystal. Uh, Sears panic attacks. I, I kind of uh, did I touch? Mm, I suppose I didn't. Yeah, I, you can use it for things like uh, panic attacks and things to to help c calm you down, calm the stress off. Yeah. So like negative energy in your own thought form as well as outside thought thought form. It's good at really grounding all that sort of thing off. I think that's everything. It's not a whole lot of stuff because I have to keep myself limited. But um, the Holistic Shop UK are really, really great. Uh, they are one of two or three online stores of a pagan variety, which I really do rate. I've never had a bad experience with the Holistic Shop UK. Their prices are more reasonable than anywhere else, hands down. And um, I was checking out a slightly larger site and they had a lot of the same stuff and it was more expensive on there. Um, they did have some different things which is unfortunate because I kind of wanted one or two of the things but I was thinking it's a shame Holistic Shop don't stock them because they would probably be more reasonable. In terms of shipping, it's nearly always next day for me. I don't know how close I am to them, but still, it's they've always been really, really good. And I'm always really pleased, and the prices, you can't beat it, I mean, you know. Um, so I have... Uh, well, I've got a crystal here, I suppose I could show you. Right, your average tumble stone. They're pretty large tourmaline pieces for £1.70. So there you go. Some witchy bargains. Tide is all over. Many blessings.